Galnet News Update, 20th of April 3309. An extraordinary video has come to light today. Allegedly shot three weeks in the future and sent back in time by firing it into a black hole. It appears to show a new variant of Thargoid, smaller than an interceptor but larger than a scout, capable of travelling very fast and with significant firepower. Four of this Thargoid's petals are smaller and they're long, thin and curved, resembling a shuriken throwing knife. It's unclear at this stage whether this is genuine footage, but if the Thargoids have developed much faster ships, then those commanders who rely on being able to boost away from high predictions and Thargoid interdictions may need to reconsider their strategy. The author of the video clip, known by what is clearly a pseudonym, Chuck Handgun, claims that these new Thargoids will not appear in the galaxy until at least Tuesday the 9th of May, possibly later. So there's still some time to engineer your ship up to 800 metres per second, so you can continue to evade the Thargoids, or there's time to learn to fight them and to prepare for the worst. Meanwhile, there are concerns over supply lines for those fighting the Thargoid invasion near Maelstrom Lygong after the Federation and Empire started another squabble, this time in the Pichich system, which lies close to the Thargoid front line. Those who prefer to fight other humans instead of Thargoids and want to get in the way of the anti-Thargoid war effort should head over to the Pichich system where they can turn in combat bonds. At the end of the week-long campaign, either the Empire or the Federation will control the system. But either way, it's perfectly possible that it will belong to the Thargoids by the end of May. In the One Drama system, the attempt to oust Azimuth Biotech continues. With the Masashi megaship back in Titori, Azimuth is vulnerable to being forced to retreat from the system, leaving it in control of just three systems, Titori, Mbuni and LHS-1163. There's considerable disquiet at the news that Salvation may have cheated death and be living on as a disembodied mind, as a guest of the Guardian Constructs. Given that the Thargoids wouldn't have invaded human space at all had it not been for Azimuth Biotech, they're not a terribly popular organisation. But their popularity may improve again if they develop another new AX weapon. Humanity is fickle about things like that. <laughs> 